on guys let's look at this problem right here this question is asking an lrc series circuit has r is equal to 11 ohm l is equal to 26 millihenries and c is equal to 29 microfarad the circuit is connected to a 120 voltage rms ac source with frequency 200 hertz what is the impedance of the circuit now to find the impedance we have to use this equation z is equal to square root of r square plus xl so this is inductive reactance minus xc that is capacitive reactance square so this is the equation for impedance now we have the resistance provided that is 11 ohm and xl we have to find that one out to find xl we have to use omega l xl is equal to omega l and we don't have the omega provided so we have to use instead of omega we can replace this one with 2 phi f l okay and 2 phi f l is uh, 2 phi times the frequency is 200 so 200 times the inductance that is 26 millihenries 26 times 10 to the power of minus 3 henries and if you calculate this one you will get 32.6726 so this is our inductive reactance now to find the capacitive reactance we have to use 1 over omega c okay omega c and again omega is equal to 2 phi f 1 over omega is 2 phi f 2 phi f c right c is capacitance that is 29 microfarad 29 microfarad so micro is 10 to the power of minus 6 farad and f is 200 so let's place that one too 1 over 2 phi times 200 times 29 times 10 to the power of minus 6 and if you calculate this one you will get 27.441 Four four one. okay now this unit and resistance units should match up in order to add them together so this one should be ohm okay so now let's go ahead and plug it in this equation r square is going to be 11 square so 11 square let's plug this here and xl is inductive reactance that is 32.6726 ohm 32.6726 six seven two six ohm minus this one twenty seven point four four one square and eleven square is one twenty one and if you add them together that's gonna give you twenty and if you add them together and in square square this one if you add you you're going to get five point something and if you square that one that's gonna give you 27.3696 and if you add them together that's going to give you 148.3696 and finally we will get 12.18 ohm okay so this is in two decimal places and this is our final answer and that's how we do this kind of problems i hope this helps thanks for watching